Let's graph this linear function. Do not forget if the function notation is bothering you, remember y is f of x, so you can call this y is equal to 2 thirds x, and you can graph it this way. Either way is just fine. The graph will be the same because y is a function of x. Now let's find, say, intercepts. Notice if I let x be 0, if x is 0, 2 thirds times 0 is 0, so this graph goes through the origin, which means the x-intercept is 0 and the y-intercept is 0. Let's find a few more ordered pair solutions then. Let's suppose I let x be maybe 6, then y is 2 thirds times 6, and what is 2 thirds times 6? 3 divides into 6 2 times, and 2 times 2 is 4. And let's let x be one other value. Since y is 2 thirds x, I'm choosing values for x. Let's suppose x is maybe negative 3. If x is negative 3, what do we have? Well, 3 divides into negative 3, negative 1 time, so I'd have 2 times negative 1 or negative 2. Let's now plot our ordered pair solutions and let's graph this linear function. By the way, since it is a function, it will pass the vertical line test. So I have 0, 0, 6, 4, that would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 to the right, and then 1, 2, 3, 4 up and then negative 3, negative 2, start at the origin, 3 to the left, 2 down, and you can see that these three points do lie along the same straight line, and that line is the graph of y is equal to 2 thirds x, or f of x is equal to 2 thirds x. By the way, notice that this line does pass the vertical line test so it is indeed a function.